Would you like to participate in a free NHL prediction contest where you could win $100? Come and join the fun and show us your handicapping skills. Details towards the end of the video. What a heartbreaking loss last night with our free pick at plus odds. With less than 30 seconds remaining, the Canucks enjoyed a two-goal lead, but unfortunately a goal by Rasmus Dalin killed our joy. Now that was just plain messed up. Today, my National Hockey League free pick is backed by one of my NHL betting systems called the Stingy Goalies. Let's review its rules quickly. If the home team won its past three games by allowing three goals or less in each of those victories, and as a money line today, which is smaller than 2.25 in decimal odds, that is plus 125 in American format, then we should bet against them. By following those rules over many years, we would have earned good profit. Can you guess which team fits these criteria on March 20th? The Capitals come into tonight's game against the Maple Leafs, having won their past three games and allowing three goals or less in each of those wins. All up, they have allowed just four goals in their past three contests against the Kraken, the Canucks, and the Flames. Washington currently has a money line of plus 120 across many bookies. Therefore, according to the rules, we must fade them. For this reason, my official NHL pick for Wednesday, March 20th, yes, I'm bringing back the lobster bell, is the Toronto Maple Leafs at odds of around minus 140 with several sports books. If you are more familiar with decimal odds, that corresponds to 1.71. The Maple Leafs have been very good on the road this season, and this is reflected in their 28 and 6 record. Furthermore, they have saluted in six of their past seven games against the Capitals, so they've had good success against that specific opponent. Toronto cruised to victory in their only other meeting this season with a convincing 4-1 win. One area of concern is that the Maple Leafs will come to Washington having played 24 hours earlier against the Flyers, which they lost 4-3. However, I am confident that they can bounce back with a win tonight. The Capitals have had to rely upon their defense a great deal this year. Overall, they are currently ranked 29th in goals scored and 27th at home. That is not good. In fact, they have averaged just 2.7 goals per game for the entire season. It is remarkable that they have a season record of 33, 25 and 9. On the other hand, Toronto has a potent offense, ranked second best in the league for goals scored per game, with an average of 3.65. William Nylander has been outstanding for the Leafs all season and currently has 87 points accumulating 36 goals and 51 assists. That's impressive! After having a relatively quiet start to the month of March, he has regained some form. In his past three games, he has scored a goal in each and has had a total of 11 shots on goal. I expect a big performance from Nylander tonight. If the lads from Toronto are going to get the job done tonight, they will need to get the puck beyond Charlie Lindgren who is the projected goalie for this contest. His numbers are quite good this year. He has played in 36 games and owns an 18-11-5 record. He has allowed only 2.59 goals per game and holds a save percentage of 915. The expected goalie for the Leafs will more than likely be Joseph Wall. He has played 18 games and has racked up a win-loss record of 9-7-1 allowed 2.89 goals per game and has a save percentage of 911. I believe that Toronto can get the spoils in this one. Yes, it is always difficult to back up 24 hours later, but we are now at the business end of the season where the cream always rises to the top. 
The Leafs will come into tonight's game desperate to rebound after dropping two in a row and will be determined to solidify the third spot in the Atlantic Division and attempt to chase down the Panthers and the Bruins. As promised, here are the details surrounding the free NHL prediction contest. All you need to do is pick the winner straight up of each of the 11 games that will take place on Saturday along with the 10 games on Sunday. So, in total, you must enter your 21 picks. But that's not it. Each selection must be graded from 1 to 21. If your pick rated 21 wins, you get 21 points. If your pick rated 8 points wins, you get 8 points, and so on. The person accumulating the most points wins the $100 prize. The contestant finishing in second place will get my picks across all sports for a week for free. Moreover, the third place finisher gets my hockey picks for a week for free. The only way to enter is to head to mjpicks.com and go to the free contest section. If you don't have an account yet, just create one in 30 seconds. What have you got to lose, really? Who knows, you may be the winner of 100 bucks, so you can take out your girlfriend or wife for dinner. I'm Professor MJ, come and play this fun contest at mjpix.com.